Uh, I'm currently the chairman of the board and the managing trustee of the Queen Lili Okalani Trust. It's a trust founded in 1909 by the last Queen of Hawaii to care for orphan and destitute children, preference to be given for those who are in whole or in part Hawaii. I'm here in Las Vegas because uh, I followed the uh, University of Hawaii football team. I am absolutely not a gambling man. I don't drink, I don't smoke, and I don't gamble. The most I will do is sit before a nickel slot and uh, you know spend 50 bucks or something for entertainment purposes. I've been a Hawaiian Homes Commissioner and the question has come up before as to whether or not the Hawaiians should have gambling uh, casinos on the Hawaiian homelands. I think we have enough social problems uh, uh, as it is. I think uh, one of our challenges is to encourage our people to increase their education, uh, to help them uh, be qualify themselves for jobs, and uh, gambling, I think, is a distraction that uh, might be uh, a magnet uh, in the wrong direction. Uh, my concern is that we have uh, in enough problems that need our own attention and that we need to solve them ourselves. And my fear is that those who could least afford it may look for a quick economic fix to their problems, such as uh, gambling uh, or other games of chance, when there is no shortcut. If we are to solve our problems, they will be solved in, in, in the way that they normally are, which is we need to improve ourselves by improving our education, improving our um, ability to work, to take care of our families, uh, to save our money so that uh, we can meet the high costs of living in Hawaii. Uh, that's why I don't think gambling is a good idea in Hawaii. The fact that there may be illegal gambling in Hawaii does not mean that we should legalize gambling for, for others. We should prosecute, prosecute the illegal gambling. Um, in my last life as a judge, that was one of my jobs.